Hey there y'all, what's up? How you doing? Hopefully this week has been going great for all of y'all. Fun fact, did you know that if you take the sticker off the top of the salt container, it turns into a salt shaker? I didn't know that until yesterday and that's because I cook. And I had no idea so I figured might as well give the information out to you guys just in case it's just as, you know, confusing because I had no idea. Now, this has nothing to do with today's video. Of course, today's video is a reaction video, and I know you guys are totally excited for this. I am too, of course. Now, I've reacted to one of this comic's videos in the past, and he was pretty funny, so I figured the rest of his videos should be pretty good. However, we won't know until we jump into them, so you know what? Let's see how this goes. I learned a lot about my girl when we moved in together. Uh, I learned she's a fucking psychopath. Uh, <laughs> just based on her Netflix queue. That's it. Just... I turn on her Netflix, it's just every type of serial killer documentary you could imagine. There's a guy who kills nuns, guy who kills hookers, guy who kills kids. <laughs> Cooking show. Who watches, who watches six hours of serial killers and then British Bake Off to wash it down? How many of you ladies in here enjoy serial killer shows? I, I actually do. They're interesting. This is why you don't like sports. I just want to let you know. <laughs> I also like sports. Is sports aren't crazy? violent enough for you. <laughs> You'll be watching football, you see someone unconscious on the ground, and you're like, okay, but why is no one raping him? What's going on? What's going on here? I mean, you already have a mask and gloves on. No one's gonna know it's you. Put a dick in that fucking man. No. Make this entertaining, please. <laughs> it's unbelievable. And you know the craziest thing about it is, it is like, you ladies will watch like serial killers and fucking rapists all the time, and it won't change your behavior at all. This is real shit. She watches a documentary about wrong. this dude who would uh, rape women who are jogging in a park at night, right? Horrifying, tragic, right? After watching the documentary, she went for a jog in a fucking park. <laughs> Bro, women are way braver than men. It's not even close to... If a single man in history was jogging in the park and got raped... We're not even jogging on treadmills no more after that. <laughs> Cardio's out the fucking equation. I mean, if he's on the you show, you get cut, right? You pull your boy in the elliptical, you're like, fam, get the <laughs> fuck off that shit! They raping dudes these days! Find a bench where your asshole's protected! Definitely don't go in that rowing machine, you just teasing them on that rowing machine. And that's a fucked up headline, too. Nobody ever talks about that. But jogger raped? That's a fucked up headline, yo. Don't ever let one. that be a headline with me. Schultz was raped jogging in the park at night. <laughs> Schultz was raped jogging in the park at night. Motherfucker, rest assured. I was running as fast as I could. <laughs> <laughs> Who's jogging, yo? You don't think I'm hitting the high knees? I got a rapist behind me, bro. There's a butt naked man with running shoes chasing me in the motherfucking park. <laughs> I can hear his feet hit the ground, dick slapping against his stomach. Oh, dang. <laughs> you think I'm tapping turbo a couple times? Schultz was running as fast as humanly possible <laughs> with an Olympic rapist. <laughs> a gold medalist from the Rape Olympics. He's probably Jamaican, they the fastest anyway. A Jamaican gold medalist from the Rape Olympics hawked him down and took that ass against his will even though he fought valiantly. <laughs> That's your headline, you print the whole shit or nothing at all. My fucking family reads the newspaper. <laughs> How am I supposed to go to Thanksgiving, my whole family looking at me like, yo, don't pass him the stuff, and he already had enough stuff. Oh. I gotta bring the Jamaican rapist to dinner to clear my name, yo. Donovan, tell him what really happened in the park, yo. They don't believe me. Tell him what really fucking happened in the park. Please, tell him. <laughs> My mom's was running as fast as humanly possible. <laughs> Some might even say it was cool running in that bar. Oh, but dang. I made him feel the rhythm. <laughs> feel the ride. I got you, white boy. It's butt fuck time. No. <laughs> That's messed up. <laughs> All right, so this video was hilarious. Andrew Schultz is incredibly funny. The last video I saw was just as funny as this one, so I'm pretty sure the rest of his material, you know, is is really good. Now, um, I get what he's saying about the whole, you know, serial killer kind of a lineup that you got. I do the same thing. 
And I don't know what that says about me because I watch those shows because they're interesting and it kind of shows you a little bit of, you know, human nature and things that people do. And in my head, it kind of makes you a little bit more aware of what's going on in the world and, you know, how to react when you're in public and that kind of stuff. Uh, but it's mainly the interest pieces uh, that, that I go for. And, um, yes, I do sometimes follow it up with some really random show like, you know, The Holiday Bake Off. Don't ask why I'm watching this during the holiday season. It's just, it happens. But uh, either way, I really enjoyed this video. Hopefully you did too. If you did, please make sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons down below. Also, make sure to hit that little notification button. That way you guys know when I drop my next video. And please check out the socials, the Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. I do update those periodically, so you'll see some good information there. Uh, make sure you like and follow on those. And if you get the chance, check out my Twitch stream on Wednesdays and Fridays. Just check my page for the times. Well, thanks for joining me here today, everybody. Stay spicy, my friends.